Hello, YouTube. Welcome back. Now, I know you guys love drama. I know you guys love to see people fail, especially fat people. Good for you evil and toxic. But I just wanted to just post this because it's very positive. Tammy Slayton news, which we don't get often. And when there's something positive about Tammy, we have got to give it to you. I gotta shove it down your throat because I know you guys are just tickling and consuming negative content daily. You like the drama, I understand it, but I'm here to bring you something very positive, something I think is positive. I only read the read, read the title. 1,000 pound sister star Tammy Slayton weight loss quotes and before and after pictures, see her now. So I'm taking it that it's positive. Hope they didn't. I just lost my train of thought. Uh, click bait us. Fans of 1,000 pound sister have seen Tammy Slayton struggle with weight loss over the span of multiple seasons, but the TLC star lost a significant amount of weight following a scary medical incident. And then they talk about the season three finale where Chris you know, took us to the hospital and Tammy could not breathe, and they placed her into a induced coma. Very scary, not healthy at all. In September 2022, the reality TV star reassured her TikTok followers that she was feeling great despite dealing with a bacterial infection. As she continues her weight loss journey, fans are cheering her on. Give updates on your weight loss. You look so much better, girl. So glad to see you're looking and feeling better. Keep it up. One user previously commented via TikTok, continue being motivated. You got this. See, some people wanna say that people love to see Tammy fail. I don't think people love to see Tammy fail or like people are making fun of her because she's obese. People are making fun of her because her attitude freaking sucks. But when she's doing something positive, very, people are very positive. People would cover that. So to the people who are like, people bully Tammy. No, we don't. We talk about and critique and make fun of the shit she says on public television because it gets weird. V, why you gotta rub your butt? Where's your hand away? <laughs> <laughs> That being said, some fans are skeptical of Tammy's recent weight loss. I spoke too soon. <laughs> no one can ever be completely happy, but that's how the internet goes, right? Considering she was in a coma for weeks throughout the history of the show, Tammy has been shown to deceive her family about her weight loss venture while her sister, Amy Slayton Holterman, has gone on to quality for beach react surgery and achieve her goal of starting a family. But apparently Tammy experienced a major milestone when she reached her goal weight in order to qualify for weight loss surgery during a February 2023 episode of the reality show. While she she needs to weigh 550 pounds, she has shocked to learn that she was actually 534.7 pounds. You know, we love to see it. That's amazing. When I got on the scale and seeing the scale was 534.7, I kind of stopped breathing for a second. Oh no, not that. You can't play it like that, Tammy. We already been through this like three times. Don't make jokes about you stopping to breathe. I'm like 14 pounds under my goal from, from over 700. That's a huge drop. Yes, it is. It's an amazing drop. Tammy then laughed and said, I did that. And now we're gonna scroll down for the weight loss. Oh, she looks like she actually has like a neck. She's smiling. Isn't it amazing what weight loss can do? It really does. Like I see all those pictures of her just angry, mad at the world, pissed off at anyone just looking at her. And now look at her. I've never seen her smile so big. Even when she was with those weirdos that liked her. See, this is just proof. The heavens open when you lose weight in a healthy way. I don't know what the fat positive community is talking about. Everything's better when you're thin. Just kidding, she's not thin yet. And I know life isn't just rose petals and peaches for people who are thin, but it makes it a lot better when you're not lugging around 400 extra pounds. People who lost weight, let me know in the comment section. So I just went to her Instagram and her one video, her neck goes all the way down to, you know, right above her chest. And then if you get the most recent from five days ago, when I'm post, or when I'm um, filming this video, her neck is like snapped up. She looks so good. Good for Tammy. I think that's amazing. I really hope she stays in there. I hope her, her lover, her husband is also doing the same. I haven't seen any updates on his weight loss, but that's really cool to see. Cause I'm not used to ever seeing, oh, you know what I just noticed? Her forehead, her forehead ain't no mole. It's, it's, it's it reduced. Cause you know, you're in trouble when, the fat has nowhere else to go but your forehead. That is dangerous and it is gone. That's amazing. Good for Queen Tammy. I think we all need to be congratulating her because this is the most weight loss I have ever seen from, like, I don't regularly watch the show, but now because I do YouTube, I like check in from time to time. I don't think I've ever seen this much weight loss from Tammy. So this is a very huge deal. I hope she continues with it. And since this video is all about positivity and is quite short at the same time, I decided because there's that other, you know, spinoff show, 1,000 Pound Sisters, 1,000 
pound best friend. I was like, how are those girls doing? And Vanessa, this is Vanessa one year ago. This is Vanessa today. How amazing. I love it. We all love to see it. You guys, just in the nick of time before I rendered this video, I decided to check my messages on Instagram and a few people messaged me about someone else we talked about on this channel. And when I saw her, I was shocked because you facing it up as I stared at my screen. So does the fat trophy wife ring a bell? Hold up on the ass, baby. Apparently she lost a crap ton of weight as well. I didn't even recognize her when people sent me this. The name sounded so familiar, but the woman in the picture did not until I scrolled onto her Instagram. So, um, I don't know. If she keeps doing what she's doing, she's gonna have to change that iconic name. I'm very happy that these women are, you know, getting their shit together. So let's all give a round of applause to these women, especially Tammy, because she the girl needs it. I'm just excited to see her whole attitude change when it comes to just living and she's able to move. Can you imagine when she's like if she loses so much weight, she's able to freely walk? Something that she hasn't been able to do in a very long time. That'll be amazing. I am really rooting for her. I'm happy to see that. We're still following the 1000 pound sister episodes, but I wanted to bring you some positivity of what she's doing, with, of how she's doing right now. Remember, this is not the part of the season. Whenever I do this, some of you guys are like, wait, I don't understand. What episode is this? You guys, 1000 pound sisters was filmed a while ago. These are posted in real lifetime. So that's it. And you guys are still gonna ask. I think I'm not going to answer. I'm just going to let you guys figure it out. Critical thinking. So anyway, I hope this video brought some type of posi positivity, some happiness, some motivation to you to uh, get out there, go walk, be active, count your calories, be healthy. Instead of eating a double Mick cheeseburger, if you already had about three this week, maybe cook something at home that's not so greasy and fattening and artery clogging. Looking at these women would motivate me to do that. Okay, remember you don't have to be a size two. Big biceps are great to scare away all the guys, but not needed to be healthy, but health is very important. And I want all my monsters to be as healthy as they can be. Even if you hate me, it's okay, it's fine. I hate certain people too, but I will still get, get your forehead over here, give you a kiss on that forehead, okay? You guys get out there and have a good day, bye. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. I've been on the flex since flex on. Neighborhood all in your eardrums. 